Man, I'm sorry. I'm being lazy. Cause probably cause. Oh, let me get the camera together. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm never like prepared. <clears throat> I'm always moving stuff and stuff like that. Okay. Y'all yeah, know me. I, I'm trying to get this lighting right. Okay, this just gonna have to, it just is what it is at this point. Okay, y'all. So, y'all already know what I'm about to do. Y'all can see, see it in the title. I'm gonna do a mukbang. I'm at work. So, I thought to myself, why not? Um, but before I get into this, into this video, y'all, make sure to comment, like, subscribe, follow me on all social medias, and we finna get into it. Racist, chair up a little bit. Okay, y'all. So I'm at work looking ratchet once again. But um, so I decided to do a mukbang, and y'all, I'm starving because I need to like clean my fork, but I'm so lazy and I'm like literally starving. Like I want to eat right now, so I'm just gonna use this fork. And really, I really need to stop being lazy and use this because I, you know, I can eat, like, pick up the food better. But, oh, well, I don't feel like washing it. It is what it is. I'm going to do the best I can do. So, y'all, I'm so excited. A new episode of Bad East West come out tonight. Oh, oh, I bet this piece going to be good. Uh, I like my cheese kind of burnt. Mmm. And I got ranch in here, y'all. Um, I bet people like, oh, you know this, but <clears throat> I like I like um a little ranch in my noodle. I mean, in my spaghetti. <clears throat> I like a little sugar and ranch in my spaghetti. Mm -mm 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 -mm. So good, y'all. Um, I'm starving. I have been, it's like five o'clock and I ain't ate all day. Like, but anyway, so a new episode of Betty's West come out. And I'm so happy. Well, I know the show is like bad. It's like made for drama. But I like they them girls is crazy as hell and they just so entertaining that I can't help it. I'm not wrong. Can't help it. I'll stop watching shows like that one day. Y'all don't judge me. Got my little caprice on. I got two on. Normally one on like I go through one on like it like it's freaking air. Like like I'm breathing in air. That's how fast I drink it. But I'm going to try to drink it a little slower because <coughs> I only got one more. And I didn't want to drink both of them at the same time. So, <sighs> so good. Y'all, I was so ooey. <sighs> Let me tell y'all. Oh, and honestly, I really don't know what I'm going to be talking about. I'm just really just rambling. But let me tell y'all what happened to me when I was um, I don't know, finna, finna get ready to get in my car and go to work. So, I already was running late. I had to be at work at 3. And I left that. I was leaving the house at like 2.50. Even though my job like 7 minutes away. But still, that's, you know. I, I normally leave at at least 2.40. So, I'm running late as it is. So, I was like, oh shoot. Let me hurry up and fix me some lunch. Because baby, 8 hours, I got to eat. <laughs> I'm sorry. So, I fixed my plate, hurry up, and I ran outside. And the wind been blowing hard as hell today. I'm talking about hard. Like, I'm glad my wig is, like, secure. Because I'm talking about, if y'all don't got y'all wig secure, baby, that your wig going to literally blow away. And I'm talking about at least a mile away. <laughs> I'm not playing. For real. That's how hard the wind was blowing. And so I had aluminum foil over my plate, but I guess I didn't, you know, wrap it tight enough. Because when I say literally all the aluminum foil flew off of my plate and like before, you know, when I fix my plate, I put, I sprinkle a little cheese on it 
and I um put a little ranch on it. And when I say the wind blew the aluminum foil off of my plate and literally like on the aluminum foil was literally half the cheese and half the ranch. And so I could have just picked it up and put it back on my plate, but the wind blew it like it, it like the cheese and ranch hit the damn ground. So I was pissed. I mean, the spaghetti is still good, but like half the cheese flew off and the ranch. I would piss. Oh, we y'all. And something else <clears throat> that I want to um, tell y'all. Like I said, we just chit-chatting. Like. But um, so... I'm so excited. I'm 24 years. I don't know if I told y'all or not, but I'm 24 years old and I've never been to a concert. And so my friend invited me to a new new edition concert. Um, it's gonna be March 12th and it's on a Sunday. Hopefully I can take off. I should. I mean, I come to work every day. Hopefully I can take off. But anyway. So um so I'm excited about that. She invited me to go. I'm so excited. And my boyfriend called us corny, but um, he called us corny because my it was my friend idea. She was like, "Do you want to dress in a regular like everybody just wear whatever they want to wear, or do you should everybody have like matching new edition t shirts I don't know. Well, if y'all don't know me, y'all gonna know. I'm like the biggest cornball ever. Like I like to be, I like to have fun. I like to, you know, celebrate. I like to do stuff, all of that. So matching all of that, decorating all of that. Like that's just me. That's my personality. So I was like, shoot, it don't matter. We could do ma matching t-shirts. And my boyfriend basically <laughs> called us like lame and corny. But, I mean, we're going to a new edition concert. How come we can't have um a new edition shirts? And, y'all, I'm going to put the shirt either on this side or on this side. I'm going to show y'all. It's cute. It's a black shirt, and it got, like, different colors in it. But um, I think what I'm going to do, I think I'm going to wear the, you know, our matching shirts or whatever. Remember, I just said it's black. Then I'm probably going to do me some, um some black uh skinny jeans or something with maybe a few holes in it a little bit like a rip at the knee or something and then i might do like some black comeback boots or something or some type of black shoe and then if it be too cold i throw on a black leather jacket or i might do a black uh puff coat from sheen it, it, it's like a half it's like a crop top puff jacket if that makes sense so i might do that if it be cold and Hopefully, I have my hair braided by the end. Hopefully. I'm going to be cute. I'm going to vlog it, y'all. I'm going to try to vlog it. I'm going to be cute. I know I look ratchet majority of the time I'm on here, but... I can get decent every now and then. So, yeah. I'm excited <coughs> about that. Oh, that's so good. Oh, we y'all. Uh, so, it's basically supposed to be like a girl's night. And my friend was like, how before the concert, because the concert started at 7, and she was like, we can go eat before the concert. And I'm like, cool, that's fine with me. She asked me. Did I think we should go before or after the concert? And I was like, I think we should go before because if the concert is seven, it'll probably last until like nine or ten. And so I'm like, well, she, we could just go before, go ahead and eat, so that way we have, you know, energy, book, jump, get crunk with them, and then, you know, after that, time to go home. <laughs> Cause I'm not gonna lie, I might have a drink when we go out to eat, but yeah, so I'm excited about that. And she get married, so it's like she having different events um, leading up until the time that she get married, and this is kind of like one of event, one of one of the events for the um 
you know, bridesmaid and maid of honor and stuff like that. Oh, and y'all, I'm so excited. I'm a maid of honor, y'all. Oh, I'm going to try to vlog, like, me getting ready and stuff. I'm so excited, like, now that I think about it, it's, like, quite a bit going on in my life that I guess I don't share it with y'all. And if I'm going to do this YouTube thing, yeah, I already know what I'm about to say. But, yeah, so I'm excited because I'm I'm going to be a um, maid of honor. And I've been two weddings before, but I've never been in a wedding, so I'm excited. Yeah, I'm full. Even though I ate majority of this spaghetti. Mm -mm -mm. That was good. Y'all, oh, 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 and this, okay, I'm going to go ahead and tell y'all. Before this wedding, baby, I need to get my teeth whitened, and I might have to get braces because I'm starting to get a gap. And I was pissed that I'm starting to get a gap because literally... I've never had a gout in my life. So it's like, damn, how come a gout starting to come all of a sudden? But I think they say it, it's caused like when your teeth shift or something like that. But why is my teeth shifting? I need to go to the dentist, y'all. But I think I might have to get braces. But I also want to get my teeth whitened. So I don't know. Hopefully I can get my teeth whitened before I get my braces. Um... So, I might have to get braces if my gap get bigger. And then, uh, we, me and <coughs> my best friend, the one who get married, we're going to get, like, facials together. And I kind of want to get my lips done just a little bit. Like, my bottom lip is, like, hang, but my top lip is literally nothing. So, I just kind of want my top lip to, like, just match my bottom lip. That's it. Just a little bit. I'm not going to lie. I want my lips done. But, um, and what else I got to do before the wedding? Um, of course, get in the gym heavy. Most definitely. And, I don't know. That's it. But, I'm excited, though, because, like I said, I've never been in a wedding. I've been to a wedding, but I ain't never been in a wedding. So, I'm excited. So, yeah. But, I'm going to try to vlog it. Well, as much as I can. But we're gonna be turned. But um, yeah, y'all, that's pretty much the end of this video. Um, like I said, it was just like a mukbang. Um well I need to stop saying like uh it is a mook it was a mukbang. My hair really irritated me. I really want my hair done. I want some braids so bad. But um, so yeah, nothing much. I was just chit-chatting with y'all bored at work. But I'll see y'all in the next video. Hopefully, the next video be a workout video. We're going to see. But, yeah. Peace.